how did all of these tanks, like, get to Holland freely? Like, how did the hall did the... Did, like, the local law enforcement of Holland not be like, yo, someone's moving tanks around? Like, we can't allow that? Oh, no. Uh-oh, there's a... Oh, no, 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 no. Uh-oh. Yeah, that's a lot of damage. Also, my cloud gaming lag. Hey, stop that. If Mugshot had all these tanks paid for, why did he even bother trying to... Oh, no. The windmill. Why did he even bother trying to bust into the hangar proper and not just make use of the tanks? Doesn't really seem to make a lot of sense, does it? Great job, Fidelity. You're the best RC pilot I've ever seen. Ah, uh, those thugs deserved it. No one sells out the Black Baron and walks away scot-free. Easy gamer moment. Okay, team. We are all set up for the Ace of Semi-Finals. Once Sly arrives at the team hangar, we'll prep the plane and suit up for competition. Yep, Ace of Semi-Finals. I love this part of the game. I love this part of the game a lot, gimme. Love this part of the game a lot. Very excited to play it again. Hey, you got money? Oh, you got money, but you don't have anything shiny. What's your favorite game of the four? Honestly, like Sly 2 or Sly 3. I'm not really sure if I like one of them more than the other. They're both just fantastic. I know that I like Sly 2 and 3 more than 1 and 4. But I just, I love them both. They both have such great positives and so few negatives. I want to save up for push attack. I think I want to save up for push attack. Top three episodes and villains. Episode six in slide two. Definitely one of my favorites. As is episode five and seven, I would say. Pretty up there. In this game, first ones to come to mind as I'm replaying are... This episode I really like. I like episode two a lot in this game. Has some of my favorite jobs. Uh, oh, hi! <laughs> Dead. Jump attack, very OP. The dude was pulling back his fist to hit me as I did my little pose for robbing him. Oh, don't I have? I do have rocket boots now. Let's go, put that on L2. We don't, we don't really, we don't need the Venice Disguise. Yeah, we don't need the Venice Disguise. Give me Smoke Bomb. And then R2 Combat Dodge. I love Rocket Boots. Oh, I love it. Bum, bum. Oh, there was another guy around the corner. Oh, I won't let me pickpocket him. Dude, this guy, you're just beating up your own dude. Later, suckers. That's not how I was hoping that would go. Yeah, you don't know I'm here. Man, that goat, ram, whatever it is, really got over the pig hitting him in the face with a bunch of wrenches, huh? Doesn't seem like the kind of thing you could just be like, oh, let bygones be bygones over, but apparently so. This, this ram is a bigger man than me. I think there's an argument to be made for slide two or slide three. Oh, but, uh... I really like pretty much all of the episodes in Sly 3, and I like the majority of them a good deal in Sly 2. I'm actually planning on doing like a uh, a ranking video with my boy Slyro, so I don't really want to go through a bunch of reasonings or try and decide what my favorites are right now, because I'm going to be making a video about it. So I'd rather wait for that video to come out when I really sit down and put a lot of thought into it, instead of being like, uh, probably this in the middle of the playthrough. So, you know, look forward to whenever those videos happen. Dead. You got something shiny? I need you to step away from the job marker so I don't accidentally trigger the job while robbing you. <laughs> Thank you. Gimme, 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 gimme. Gold medal, very nice. I think there are arguments to be made for Sly 2 and Sly 3 on being the best game. 
And really, at the end of the day, I think whether you like slide two or three more just heavily comes, I mean, something being your favorite game always comes down to personal preference, obviously, but like, it's really just like some people are gonna be more disposed towards liking the way Sly 3's jobs go, and some people are gonna be more disposed towards liking the way Sly 2's jobs go. I think there's a fair case to be made for both 2 and 3 for being the best of the Sly Cooper franchise. And let me be clear, Sly 1 and 4, also very good games. But I just think Sly 2 and 3 are significantly above them overall. Dude, there are so many shiny objects around. Let's go. Hurry, 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 hurry. Thank you. Yo, gold pocket watch! Over 100 coins. Oh, and you turned around. Ow. Really need a Sly 5 to be made? Say it louder for the people in the back, man. That's what I'm talking about. Make more Sly Cooper games. This franchise could just, it could go so far. If they just got a good developer to keep making more of them. I'm not seeing any shinies. So let's get into the Aces semifinals, lads. Suit up, partner. Almost time for the semifinals. Stay sharp, Sly. Iceland and Belgium will be at each other's throats up there, but you're still outnumbered. Relax, Mom. This is gonna be great. By plane time. One of my least favorite things being burned alive at 500 feet I'd, I'd put it pretty low what's the slowdown button in square let me let me kill you there we go nice nice I need some more ammo don't mind me don't mind me Whoop. Fine. I love the biplane battles in this game I think they're very fun Oh no, getting too high. I ran into it. It's fine, we're good, we're good. I will say you can play two player mode against another player and there are like special power ups you can get to do like napalm and other really cool stuff. I wish that they were included in the main story too. I can understand why they're only in the multiplayer mode where you like play against another human player but it'd be so much fun to use them in this. Save 10% if you buy next year's tickets now. Come on. Nailed it, nailed it. 11 of 25. I've only taken a third of my health. Not too shabby. Not too shabby at all. We're going through the barn. Oh, there's not ammo in here. I stormed the barn. I did it. Oh dear, it's so cloudy. The cloud gaming. Hey. Hey, you. Come here. Get, get over here. I'm gonna get you. You know what I just remembered you can do in this game? The quick turnarounds with the circle button. Oh dear. Yeah. Alright, alright. Not worth the damage taken, but that's, that's another KO. Excuse me. Pardon me. Coming through. Can't you also, like, set the trees on fire? Yep. Totally can. That tree's on fire right there. Hey, you. Team Iceland scum. Oh, Team Belgium scum! Nailed it. Nailed it. Alright, only ten more. Ten more. So far, so good. Excuse me, sir. 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 Nailed it. Ba-bum-bum. Come here. 
let me end you. Nailed it. All. All. According to Kekar. Oh dear, that guy almost ran into me. I can't really afford to do many more kamikaze hits. Like, maybe one. Because I also have to take into account that an enemy might actually start hitting me at some point. Thankfully, the AI is really bad at aiming. You're out of bullets. Whoops. Lie down underneath one of the bridges and pick up some more rounds. I'm on it. I don't know how on earth I reloaded this thing mid-flight like that, but whatever. Hello. Dude, you can't just be going straight up like that. All right, five remain. Pretty pog champion, as the kids would say. Come here, you. Got him. Hey. Hey. Come back here. Come on, come on. How are you still alive? Got him. Hi there, buddy. Thought you could fly up above me, huh? You're the last two. Belgium first. Come here. I'll kamikaze you. Don't think I won't. Come here. Oh, I got you. Oh, I got you. Who even needs bullets? Bullets are for losers. I... I'm gonna... I'll, I'll go straight up. Don't think I won't. Oh, dear. Got him. Nailed it. Job complete. Likes the slides flying, we're officially in the Ace and Finals. Our opponents, Team Mugshot and Team Black Baron. The rules in the finals are a bit different than normal. Whoever takes out the defending champ gets the title. Hear that, boys? It's all about taking down the Baron. Our only real competition will be Bugshot himself. We need to remove him from the competition. Here's the plan. I'll challenge him to a fist fight out in the town square. Sly, you whine and lure Inspector Fox to the same place. When the two meet, the sparks are sure to fly. With some luck, the big guy will get carted off to jail, and we'll have clear skies for the fight. However, the Baron won't be so easy to deal with. He commands an enormous team of flyers and has been known to bring in a squad of limp gunships when things look grim. The answer to our problem isn't obvious, although it is potent. Behold, Lupus Gigantormus. I'll drug the beast so that the Guru will be able to ride it and take out some of the local guards, who also serve as the Baron's pilots. Obviously, the fewer enemy pilots Sly has to deal with in the finals, the better. Next, I'll hack into the aircraft control tower. If successful, I'll be able to intercept any messages the Baron might send to his gunships. All right, team, we've got all night to prepare. If we take this thing, it'll mean more than a trophy. Penelope is sure to join our gang. After her stellar work defending our hangar, I'm sure we'd all agree that she's a prime recruit. How, how'd you get a picture of Penelope? How'd you get that picture of actual Penelope instead of fake Penelope? How'd you do that? We only have Bentley missions? I don't remember that. Grapple cam! We need the grapple cam for later missions, so we will buy that Fists of Flamer back, lads, but we gotta take style and obliteration. Oh, that's right, you can get shadow power in this game. Spin attack level three is so awesome. Ah, I need more money! <laughs> I'm- I need to be rich. Oh, man. What on earth is happening in chat? Would you say Sly is a good boss or a good person? I don't really think he's a boss. The team is kind of like a- a team. It's not really, I mean, I guess Sly is the leader, but I mean, Bentley's the one who comes up with most of the plans and what to do and whatnot. When I played the first Contessa level in Sly 2 as a child, it freaked you out? I had, uh, I think uh, someone else in chat said it was the same for them, but when I played, oh, Beauty and the Beast, I love that mission. Giant Wolf Massacre, I love both of these missions. I'm a huge fan of both of these missions. But, uh, in the first Sly Cooper game, the Ms. Ruby level with the giant snake 
that would uh, show up. That always freaked me out as a kid. Which mission do I want to do first? I want to steal this guy's gold first, is what I want to do. His shiny object. That guy up there's got a shiny object, too. Your boy needs this cash. I have so many cool thief things that I need to buy. Gimme. Just one more, just one more pull, one more tug, there we go! I'm telling you, man, silver medals. Sly 5 is supposed to release on 23rd of September 2023, Google says. Uh, you found something fake. There's no news about any kind of Sly Cooper game being in development or potentially coming out at any point or anything. So, you know, cite your source, basically. What on Google told you that? And it's definitely a lie. Like, this is not even... Not even a slight possibility. The idea that a Sly Cooper game would even be in production right now, let alone have an actual release date. Even if you found something that said like, oh, a Sly Cooper game is being made, I wouldn't believe it without some serious proof. I almost walked into this guy because I was glancing at chat. Oh, you saw me. Rip, I was looking at chat again. But why the release date? Because people like to lie on the internet to generate clicks. Whatever site you found that says that is just trying to get people to click on it to make ad money. Why'd they make a plot twist at the end of Sly 4? Probably to try to make another game, but then they ended up not doing that, either because of money reasons or changing their mind or whatever. It's like, there's there's no Sly Cooper games in production, dude. Any, any, what do, what do the kids say? Cope? Any, anything else is your, is copium? You're coping, etc. Let's do this. Aha! A perfect feral specimen of Lupus Gigantormus. So, let me get this straight again. You plan on stalking that thing, drugging it, putting the guru on board, and setting the two free to smash up the guards? An airtight plan, I agree. In simplicity itself. By channeling the wild destruction housed in that bloodthirsty creature, we should be able to thin out the Black Baron's ranks. Which, of course, means fewer enemy pilots flying against you in the finals. I'm all for evening the odds in our favor, but come on, this plan seems a little risky. Not at all. I've modified my sleep darts with heavy doses of skunk balm. It should be enough to pacify the beast, provided he doesn't catch wind of me first. All right, that sounds okay. You can hang back and shoot him at a distance. Uh... Well, given the weight of the darts, I'll need to sneak up behind him and take a shot within a few meters. Meters? Quit trying to freak me out and put the guru on the binocucom. After I put the wolf to sleep, it'll be up to you. Fawada, hoja. Thanks, guru. You always know just what to say. He really does. The guru is the rock of this team. He really holds us all together. I love quad jumping. Oh, I love it. You got something shiny there? No, you don't. Hi there, Lupus Ginormous. So you can see we're close enough to hit this thing when we get the little marker. He's mad. Yeah, it is the rabbit. That rabbit did it. He's the one that drugged you, I swear. See you later, suckers. Oh, what are you guys doing up here? <laughs> There's a bomb there, idiots. I'm close enough to Lupus Ginormous right now? Oh, hello! Didn't drop that down there for that guy. Excuse me. Please? Please die, thank you, holy cow. All right, there he is. The, dude, the cloud gaming cannot handle this skunk smoke effect. Hi! No impact. Get within a few meters behind the wolf, then fire. Otherwise, the darts just bounce off. All right, yeah, you can't shoot him from the front. Duly noted. Leave me alone. I blame 
the lag. Yeah, the steam effect with... I remember it being a little iffy on the original version too and on the PS3 at times. But it gets like really framey in uh, cloud gaming at times. Oh, did you see me? All right, we're good, we're good. Hey, don't, don't get a whiff of this, okay? Not close enough. You really do have to be right up this thing's butt. Nice one, Later. Yeah, suddenly jumping with the smoke effect going out, the game is like, we, we cannot compute this. Cloud gaming was not built to, to pull this off. And the best thing to do after nailing this guy is to super jump away. Got it. Oh, I sure did. Uh-oh. Yep, okay, I knew that was gonna happen. <laughs> That's fine, I blame the lag on that one. That first time I, like, got super hit and chased down by three enemies was because the game lagged me out as I tried to jump away. 